We volunteer at Salome every year around the holiday season. It's a pretty popular time for people in general to volunteer and we try and get about six or seven slots for various teams to fill. Everyone knows it in Winnipeg, it's a larger organization. Also, it's rather easy for us to set up times that kind of work with our training and school schedules. Uh, I feel like it's important to do stuff like that because growing up I really didn't have nobody to do stuff like that because I never, like, I grew up struggling, didn't have things and, you know, back then I was on the other end of it, now being on the end of, you know, me helping, it just lets me know I'm doing something with my life. Like, I'm always down to do stuff like that, you know. Like, I have fun with it, you know. We had to throw certain stuff in certain buckets, so, you know, it got to where we're just shooting stuff in different buckets, like. Volunteers are a huge part of Salem. We have volunteers helping in our clothing program, sorting through donations, helping people have access to the donations that we receive. Without the thousands of hours that volunteers put in each year, uh, we wouldn't be able to offer the services that we do. It's life, everybody's gonna struggle with life. You know, life hits some people different types of ways. You know, the people that it does affect, like I feel like organizations like that are very helpful and beneficial. It's like a God's blessing. It makes me really happy, it kind of warms my heart to see us taking time out of our busy schedules to do stuff. And I think athletes can be seen as a role model, at least to like younger kids and future bison athletes. And I think showing them that we do these things and these initiatives, I think it can kind of get the ball rolling for like change and people doing things in their community to give back.